Hey guys, it's your girl Kia from Wigaliciousfix.com. I wanted to come to you today and share a little bit about my weekend. I think, well, you probably don't want to see any pictures. If you want to see pictures, you know you can check me out on Facebook. How about I don't even know my Facebook name because my husband didn't make my account. It might be Wigalicious or it might be Kia Abanyi. Um, check me out on there. You can also follow me on Twitter. I have not been on Twitter in months and that's because I just, I don't know. I just, I think I made the account because, oh, the Breslin, uh, Marquita Breslin asked me to follow her on there. And then I just got on Twitter and I had a couple people follow me and, um, I haven't really done any updates or anything. Um, but, um, I'll be working on that. But, yeah, you can see the pictures of Great Adventure on uh, my Facebook. But we had a good time. We went with my brother-in-law and his fiance, And we went with my babysitter and her boyfriend. And we had an awesome time. But let me tell you how it rained off and on continuously. And I was really mad about it because I wanted to get on the King car. And as soon as we was in line, it started pouring down rain. And they wouldn't run it, obviously, because... I ain't they say because it's the tallest roller coaster and the first thing that the uh, lightning, if it does hot, you know, hit, it's going to hit that roller coaster. So I'd rather not be a fried person trying to get on the roller coaster, you know. So we got on Bizarro, which was fun. And we got on Superman. That was fun. And he almost was fighting on there. And it was so funny because my husband started videotaping it with his camera. And the dude was like, is that going to be on YouTube tomorrow? So he was laughing about that. We had a good time with that. Security had to usher them out of the line. Um, it was crazy. And we got on The Dark Knight, which surprisingly was really, really cool because I was not expecting that. I think it's like a, an adult version of um, Space Mountain. It was really cool. It was fun. And at the end, I was ready to jab that thing because it scared the mess out of me. It scared the mess out of me at the end. It was so crazy. Um, so we had a good time. We left there about like 7 because we were getting ready to get on El Toro, which I was so excited to get on. And it really started pouring down rain. Like serious, serious rain. And um, it was funny because everybody's like, oh my gosh, you won't get wet. I was like, you get wet in the shower? So, why are y'all stressing? But, um, yeah, we had a good time. And we didn't have to really pay to eat because it was my husband's um, job's like a picnic. So, next weekend, my mom's job is having hers at Dorney Park. And um, it's all, you know, they feed you and all that other stuff. So, that's kind of good because that really cuts out. Because, let me tell you something, the drinks, they had a drink, and the drinks were like six ninety nine. They told me about ninety nine cent every refill, every time you get a refill. So you think I'm gonna come all the way up here to Great Adventure to get a refill? Really, dude? Really? Anyway, so we had a good time and uh, walked around and um, felt like a little kid again. But let me tell you, my body was not feeling like a little kid the next day. <laughs> it was crazy. I was like, oh my gosh, my legs hurt so bad. Um, I know you're looking at my hair and saying, did she go and get a weave? No, I did not get a weave. This is my new wig. It is called Rachel. And um, it's different. You know, there was a color for me. You know, I got 30 on the top going into number two. Uh, and I absolutely positively love it um i have been looking what happened was how this all came to be number one i was talking to fatima one time and she was asking me because um for her birthday after her birthday she went to vegas and she wanted to have her hair so she got the indian hair where it's straight and then it gets curly when it's wet and she was saying girl i seen this girl come in i don't know what kind of weave she had but i did not see any of her hair it was all the hair the weave hair and she said it looks so freaking nice and i said oh i think i've seen a couple of people on youtube doing that um it's called like the invisible part or what have you so she was like oh, okay so i went on maybe a week after that and i was researching or what have you and i found a couple of people that did it and i said okay i could probably do that and then like the past week 
she was we were talking and she was like well what you gonna do with your hair for the summer i said i don't know i really don't because i'm so weird with my hair you know i want it out then i don't want it out and then i want a wig and then i don't want a wig and da -da 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 -da. and so i said well maybe i'll do the invisible part weave on myself so i'm like okay so then i look around again and i get to thinking there's got to be a way you know your girl's thinking it's got to be a way that I can make that into a wig. And the only reason is my hair is so weird. The only way that I, and I would definitely be able to, I would definitely have to have like an invisible part because whenever I do a weave and I part my hair and I put my hair with the glue, um, it itches. And my, it seems like I can't get human hair in contact with my scalp because it itches. Um, even like when I had the micros, like I told you guys, it was itches so bad. So, I was saying to myself, I would love to do the invisible part on myself as a weave for the summertime. And then I said, but there's got to be a way that I can do it in a wig so that when I want to take it off and take care of my hair, I could do that. Well, your girl was thinking, I had some leftover lace because I taught myself, I know how to do the lace wig in a whole, but let me tell y'all, if you have never done it, it took me all of 45 minutes to get one hair in the lace. Do you understand? One hair in the lace. I was like, I can't do this. So I went in my drawer. I said, let me go in my drawer, my little hair drawer, and let me see what I can do. So I found some lace that I have. I want to get some darker lace, though. I'm going to order some darker lace. If you order the Rachel... You can get the Rachel with light lace like I have, which is almost like white, basically. It's so light. and Or you could get it um, tan or brown. And um, let me fix my laptop here. And it's just a small lace piece, and I'm going to put it on my website that you can have it added to some of the wigs if you want. Um, but I'm going to call it my Wiggalicious Lazy Lace Closure. Um, I'm going to put it on the website tonight. And, um, cause it's kind of late, but I'm gonna do it before I go to bed because I want to put that one there. Um, and Rachel will be on there tonight as well. But I just want you guys to see, I did the, um, the part as you can see. And I, you know me, I'm trying to get them as natural as I can for you ladies. Cause I love you ladies. I just got a letter for somebody and it just, I mean, it, it's a blessing to be doing what I'm doing. And I'm really praising God about that. Um, it is really all him. And none of me seriously um so i wanted to show you guys this it's a regular wig cap but i just put a small lace piece on there sewn it on and did the actual invisible part technique to it so um you don't need any tape i was going to say oh if you want the tape but really if you look at it you don't need no tape you feel me so um I'm just letting you guys see it up close because you know how I do. I don't want y'all to be like, oh, it's da -da. so I want you guys to see that I'm trying to do more natural, more natural. I told y'all, when you get into that thing, you want to perfect your craft. And that's what I'm trying to do. I'm really trying to perfect my craft. Um, my husband came home and he was like, oh, wow, babe, you look hot. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm excited about it. But um, I'm going to also try the technique with um, some other hair textures. And come back with y'all. <coughs> come back to y'all um, with some more stuff. Um, I'll probably do a couple more. I'm not gonna. The most I might do five more styles for the summertime, um, being that we only have two months. So it's you know um, that's what I think I'm going to do. Maybe the most. But um, I just wanted to show you guys this. I love it. Tell you about my little weekend that I had. And I had a good time without the kids. We went without the kids. I felt like a little kid myself. So I had a good time. I will talk to you guys later. I love you all. Hello to all my new subscribers. And I thank you guys for my old subscribers for sticking around and watching me and growing with me. And I love you all. And I just want to say, remember you too can look wigglicious. God bless.